Welcome to COC4, the final challenge in your computer system servicing adventure. First up, backup and restore. First up, on the client computer, go to Drive D. Create a new folder. Name it Backup and Restore. Inside this folder, Create some sample files, like a bitmap image, a subfolder, and any other files you want to include. Next, switch to your server machine. Go to Drive D and create the same folder. Name it Backup and Restore. But this time, instead of adding files inside it, we will share this folder across the network. Right click on it, select Properties. Then go to the Sharing tab. Click Share, add permission for everyone. and modify the permission level to be read and write, then click Share, and Done. Now your server's folder is ready to receive backups from your client machine. Now, back to the client machine. Click the search bar at the bottom, type Backup and Restore. Then press Enter, a new window will open. Look for the option, go to Backup and Restore, Windows 7, and click it. In that window, click Set Up Backup. Or if it's already set, click Change Settings. Now, choose Save on a Network, then click Browse. Find the name of your server, expand it, and select the shared folder called Backup and Restore. Click OK. Enter network credentials such as username BGFCCSS, administrator and password BGFC2025. Click OK. Click Next, then choose Let Me Choose. You will now see a list of available drives. Expand Drive D and check the folder, Backup and Restore. Important, uncheck the box that says, Include a system image of drives. Then click Next. Then click, Save Settings and Run Backup. Now sit back and wait until the backup progress is complete. You just sent your important files flying through the network into the safe hands of your server. Now, let's try restoring the backup and delete the folder you backed up earlier. The one named Backup and Restore. Yes, delete it completely so we can bring it back like magic Switch to Backup and Restore window. Click Restore My Files. In the pop-up window, choose Browse for Folders. Navigate to the shared folder on the server and select Backup and Restore. Click Add Folder. Click Next, now select, in the original location, so the folder comes back exactly where it was. Click Restore, and let the process do its work. Now go back to Drive D and boom, the deleted backup and restore folder has just been revived, like it was never destroyed. 
by your own good hands, mission complete. You now know how to back up and restore like a certified IT ninja.